the voice is helpful. I would never shut down the voice because the voice says things like, um, take care of yourself, make sure you get a lot of rest. Um, the voice says, you can do this. Um, the voice says, okay, if, if you're procrastinating or if something's a little bit boring, like, let's find a creative way of doing it. Um, I don't have, again, like after, after five, six years of building something, um, I don't have as much of the negative self-talk anymore. Because I've had, this is a key, right? Starting something gives you a basis to work from. The scary part is starting and doing something new. Because you have nothing to go on. Like, you're kind of leaping out into this void and you don't really know if it's going to work. You have no reference point. But once you start, that's how you build the reference point. You're kind of building your own stepping stones. And so, um, yeah, the little voice just kind of says, like, be curious, ask questions, and find out what people want, and then decide whether or not, you know, I want to be the person delivering that to them. So, the little voice inside me also reminds me to get more sleep. <laughs> I don't get enough sleep. Um, the little voice inside me also says, it's okay to love my work. Because I do really love what I do. <laughs> if you were to ask my husband, he probably thinks I work too much. And I'm like, this is not work. Like, <laughs> like this is fun. Um, and that's okay too. That's okay too. 